School holidays can be a really fun time for you and your children, but sometimes planning activities can be rather difficult. For working parents, it can be a really challenging time, but thinking ahead, you can find different ways to keep your child entertained. Usually what I do with the kids at the beginning of the holidays, I get them to pick two activities per week. Make sure you make decisions as a family, as a whole family. Uh, bring the children in, ask them what they want to do and make the decision together. I like playing in the garden and I like, and I like gardening. We take them to parks, play in the garden. We're, we're very lucky we've got a house with a garden so it's, it's, it's easy enough to just open the back door and they can run about. You could have picnics and get the children involved in making the sandwiches and putting healthy things in there. This time is a, the very good weather last week. So we had been to the parks and we had to go for the picnic also. It's fun for us also as a parent and it's definitely fun for kids always. Fun doesn't have to be expensive. Sometimes you can find uh, free admission for children and adults. Look out for vouchers in papers, internet and on cereal boxes even. The benefits of bringing them to the beach are the fact that um, they get lots of exercise and they burn off so much energy and it's free. I like to um, play with my sister at the beach. If you do decide to go out for the day, don't forget to involve your children in the preparation. I like to um, make a squiggly pattern on a stray pattern. I like, I like building sandcastles and I like looking in the rock pools. Uh, sometimes we rock pool or build sandcastles, the traditional kind of things, but other times we can play rounders or just come for a picnic, just get some fresh air. I'm happy when I go to the beach. The weather's not so good, there's lots of other things you can do at home. Here we're playing with cornflower, which is very cheap and really good fun. It's very tactile, um, one minute it's hard and you can make a ball out of it, and then the next minute it's very gloopy. Lots of arts and crafts and painting and gluing and all the messy stuff. <laughs> During the holidays, childcare can be sometimes a problem, but there are a lot of places like schools and children's centres that offer play schemes. Remember, even though it's good to have lots of structured activities during the holidays, they don't always need that. It's okay to do things at home and let them entertain themselves from time to time. School holidays can be real fun, and it gives you and your child a chance to really get to know each other and do things that you wouldn't normally have time to do.